All righty, folks, in episode number one this week, we talked about what a tech-enabled service is, why they are going to be the wave of the future, why Hemlane tackled the hardest one in property management first, the service request. Now we're going to get to look at what they're rolling, what they have rolled out, and likely talk about what they are rolling out because there are a lot of services in the property management space that will be advantageous for all of us. Dana, what do you got? All right. I can't wait to share it with you. Um, so just as a reminder, we offer property management, a property management platform for you to manage your rental properties. Um, no one size fits all. You will talk to one um, uh, real estate investor who says, I am fantastic at accounting. I want to do all of that myself. You'll talk to another that says, I'm a general contractor. I want to do all the repair coordination on my own. One size does not fit all. And so our goal is to say, great, we provide the software and the services to help you build the business that you want. And there's various different packages. There's various different add-ons to get exactly what you want and need. Um, so when you're in your Hemlane dashboard here, we have a new tab. This is not actually live yet. It's called services. It goes live tomorrow. Okay. And um, when you click on it, it will actually redirect you to this all services tab. And this is where we're going to be starting to share with you what types of services we have. We also have, you know, legal contract um, uh, and connections to tech-enabled services for legal, et cetera, to basically help provide a plug and play. We also connect you to licensed agents. So if you do need some sort of licensed activity, we do work with agents, we do with work with property managers to help you with that. So under this all in, all services tab, what you will now see is what you've been enrolled in, and then if you haven't enrolled in something, it will be down here as available, av available for you to connect with that service. And up here, what you'll see is, okay, for Leasing Plus, this is us helping find and place a tenant. How many open requests do you have for Leasing Plus? How many messages? For repair coordination, how many rentals are currently enrolled in our repair coordination program? And for requests, how many requests are currently open that we are coordinating? You can go to the maintenance and repair tab here and also see those coordinated requests. But this helps um, allow you to see, hey, throughout all of these tabs here that you see of everything from advertising your rental to managing the day to day, here are the ones that are actually service oriented, not just software oriented. And it's the same thing with um, Eviction Plus, where we can go ahead and have Eviction Guard, which kicks in anytime a tenant is late. We'll go ahead and make sure a mediator calls. We can also do the process serving to get the notice to them. Um, and then you can see how much slate, what we're doing, view the details, et cetera, all of that um, here. So anyway, this is just a stepping stone and building block to one, listening to our customers who say sometimes, wow, I didn't even know you had repair coordination because it's so hidden under maintenance and repair for you to actually be able to see what services these are that we have. And so at any time, you can go ahead and click view details and then go into that service, see what it is, what milestones, how many prospective tenants, open repair requests you have, if you have any messages to check, all of that in here. Keep in mind, you will also be getting notifications on this. So you will get notifications, whether it's via email, text message, however you have it set up um, to go through and view all of your requests from there. I like it. I like it. What else you got? Um, and then um, as far as additional services that we'll be adding, um, yeah. it will definitely be um, down here. You'll be seeing these added into here. Um, there will be certain ones that um, will be added everything from um, insurance to also being able to provide you additional from a mortgage perspective to look at refinancing right now. That's probably, you're probably not going to refinance at the rates yeah. that they have now, uh, yeah. but in the future, and then additional services associated with um, legal advice and stuff like that will all be integrated into here. Yeah. Cause when you look at, you look at, when you think about tech enabled service and you kind of break down, I liked your example of accounting, right? There's one thing to have accounting software, but then the services around it, it's kind of the advice, the checks and balances, the protection, right? The IRS audit was a great example with Intuit. Um, there's just so many places you could take this. And again, by by tackling repair coordination first, now adding in leasing, it really does bode well for, hey, 
what about the other aspects insurance taxes yeah. you know all of those yeah things, so. and like under leasing here there's also um inspections so you'll see like this one has an inspection attached right. to it so i could click on it and the inspection report would be uploaded here and i could view it yep. so that would be in here however um with it, you know, annual inspections has been one. They say you do the move out inspection. Why couldn't I get an annual inspection done? And right. then you have different price points that a real estate investor is willing to pay. If it is me personally, I would have a third party come and inspect the place, right. especially because if there's a pet, um, I want to know, like, maybe they've hidden the pet for the inspection, but I see Lisa, uh, leashes and dog bowls, and it smells like there's a dog in there, you know, those types of, of details that a third party would do. But we've heard from some of our users that they say, hey, actually, for the annual inspection, we just want the tenant to be able to do it through a video. We don't want to have to pay for a third party. And to me, that is obviously education would say maybe you should be getting a third party inspector. But to me, it would be like, well, that's better than no inspection, right? Um, so there's certain um, services like that where we can really segment them out now that there's this services tab in here. Nice. I like it. And again, this is something you can roll out and iterate uh, as we move forward, right? So you probably have a, a, a roadmap of stuff, but it, it's something you can add. Uh, exactly. A roadmap of services here. Yep. I like it. I like it. So this is something that will be out, I guess, Friday, the 22nd. Is that right? Yep. Tomorrow this goes live. It will be um, uh, promoted starting tomorrow. And you guys are the first ones to even know about this. Awesome. Well, you know what I'll do is I'll make sure this goes live on the 22nd, folks. So this is available. If you wanted to take the trial and start playing with this, Dana, how would they do that? Yep. You can go to www.hemling, H E M. L A N E dot com. Um, click try for free and then mention one rental at a time for 20% off your first year. Awesome, Dana. Thank you so much. Thank you for being here each week. Take care. Thanks so much. Yep.